and welcome while we read about Philip Bazaar, who was the first South African Medal of Honor recipient. Uh, he's the first Hispanic to be awarded the Congressional Medal of Honor. He was a Navy seaman in the Union Navy, and he earns this in the assault on Fort Fisher. Fort Fisher is where he saw uh, heroic combat action, and he saw this heroic combat action on January 12th, 1865. Philip Bazaar was a resident of Massachusetts, and he was also an immigrant from Chile who joined the, United, uh, the Union Navy at New Bedford, Massachusetts. Bazaar was assigned to the USS Santiago de Cuba during the American Civil War. It's pictured at the bottom here. Santiago de Cuba was a wooden, brigantine-rigged, side-wheel steamship under the command of Rear Admiral David D. Porter. In the later part of 1864, Union General Ulysses S. Grant ordered an assault on Fort Fisher, which was a stronghold of the Confederate States of America. Fort Fisher protected the vital trading routes of the Wilmington's port in North Carolina. Rear Admiral uh, Porter was in charge of the naval assault, and General Benjamin F. Butler was in charge of the land assault. After the failure of the first assault, Butler was replaced by Major General Alfred Terry. A second assault was ordered on January 1865. Bazaar, at the time, was aboard the USS Santiago de Cuba and served in both assaults on the fort. On January 12, 1865, both ground and naval Union forces attempted the second assault. In this second assault, Bazaar and five other crew members, under the direct orders of Rear Admiral Porter, carried dispatches during the battle while under heavy fire from the Confederates uh, to Major General Alfred Terry. Bazaar is the very first Medal of Honor recipient from South America. And I apologize, I can't give you more detail. Um, I've tried to find more about him, and I have not been able to find very much more. Um, I do think it's fascinating that he is the very first South, Amer uh, South American, so first Hispanic to, um, to win the Medal of Honor. And it must have been incredibly intense. He was carrying letters, uh, carrying orders, and... He was being shot at, and apparently five other guys were with him. Well, we, I can't find anything else on him. Um, hopefully in the future, I'll be able to remake this video and make it a little bit better. But for now, all I can really give you is he's the first Hispanic to be awarded the Congressional Medal of Honor and that he participated in the assault on Fort Fisher and that it must have been pretty intense stuff for him to earn the Medal of Honor because you don't get that without doing something incredible. I hope you're learning and I hope you're having fun.